G'day guys, Patrick Flobin here. We've been in Doha for two weeks now, so we thought we'd give you an insight to what life's like here in the guitar bubble. Let's go. So, it's 8am, like every morning, we're off to breakfast. Let's go. Morning, Les. How are you, mate? Pretty good. Every morning and evening, before breakfast and dinner, we're required to take a temperature check. <laughs> you leave. Are the boys join and then... All you do is get someone. Breakfast is compulsory between 8 and 10 a.m. every day. However, it's staggered and the players can choose when they come, so long as they don't miss it. So, with breakfast done, as you know, we're not allowed to leave the hotel, so it's back to our rooms for a couple of hours before we hit the gym. Our morning session is about maintaining and building muscle strength, which we transfer to our field drills later in the day. This is the Esdam Palace Hotel, where we've been staying in Qatar for the past two weeks. As you can see, very beautiful. We've been staying up on the second floor. We've also been sharing the hotel with Perth Glory and Melbourne Victory. And they're located on the first and ground floor. Nice. Now that that's done, we're off to the pool to cool down and recover. Getting in the pool after a tough gym session is essential to help cool the muscles and allow them to recover quicker. That's the pool recovery done. Now we're off to have a shower and have lunch with the boys. Hasta luego! <laughs> Usually at mealtimes we all sit in large groups, however in the bubble we must eat in pairs and stay at a distance from each other, just in case. Now that lunch is done, we're back to the room for a couple of hours of free time before we head off to training again. It's important to stay in your room, not just because congregating is frowned upon in the bubble, but also to save energy ahead of training. In the afternoon, we have our pre-training activation session, where we stretch and get our limbs moving again ahead of training. So, it's about 15 minutes now before we head off to training. We've got a quick video analysis of the opposition before we get out there. We usually have video sessions about three or four times a week where we'll look at our own performance or what to expect from the opposition. So guys, it's 4.30, ready to head off to training now. Got my boots, my water ready to go. This is actually the only time we're allowed out of the hotel as a team. But, of course, before I go, got to get my temperature check. Masks are compulsory as soon as we leave the hotel. If one man goes down, the whole team could be at risk. Training will last anything from one hour to 90 minutes, depending on how close we are to match day. And then it's straight back to the bubble. Alright guys, so that's it. An hour and a half training's done. Now we're going to get a police escort back to the hotel, have a shower and then go to dinner. And of course our protein shakes, our head of high performance, Elias Booker always says, timing is everything. Then we do it all again tomorrow. That's it. Is that it? <laughs>